Hey guys, what's going on? It's Obes Gaming back again with another video, and Winter Wildcards promo is finally here. And with that, we do have an objectives player to complete, and that player is Messias from AC Milan. So what we'll do is we'll jump into objectives, take a look how to how to complete him, take a look at the card itself, and then build a squad to get it done as quickly as possible. So jumping straight in, as you can see, we have Junior Messias. He's 86 rated, a cam from the Serie A, and he's Brazilian. So quite a lot of nice links there. And on the face of the card, you know, it looks like a pretty decent card, 88 pace, 88 dribbling, good passing, decent shooting as well. So with the right chem style, he could be a really usable card. Looking at the objectives themselves, we have Samba scoring, which is to score 15 goals using Brazilian players in the life of friendly, friendly Frost, so that's a new, uh, a new friendly there. We also have Ice Cold Cam, which is to assist three goals with, with cams, okay. Serie A streak, score using Serie A players in 10 separate matches, very simple, and win to win, so win 5. So score in 10, win 5, assist with cams, and goals with Brazilian players. So, what we want to do is let's go and take a look at the friendly, and it is a max chemistry with max 1 lone players, so that makes things a lot easier to build a squad for, but obviously we do want to prioritise the players that are going to get those challenges done. Jumping in to take a look at the card itself, here we go, got my concepts. So he does have five star skills, unfortunately only three star weak foot, and he's left footed. But still, those five star skills are pretty huge, so especially for a, you know, a free objective player, if you will. It looks like he's got decent stats and five star skills, weak foot is a bit disappointing, but other than that, it's looking pretty good so far. Jumping into attributes, pace, there's not much of a split there, which is what we like to see, so we can boost that nicely if we need to. In the shooting stats, decent, you know, 81 shooting for a cam is pretty decent, it's not unreal, but you know, it's being dragged down by the volleys and penalties, which we really don't care about too much. Passing's good, you know, in the key places like short passing, 89 is superb, long passing's still good at 81. And the dribbling, again, reactions is the lowest there at 83, but all the others look pretty good. Composure, again, a little bit low at 77, so you may want to look, maybe boosting that, those reactions up with the chem style. Defending's fine, um, obviously we don't, we're not too bothered about that on a card like this. And the physicals, the stam is the one that we really care about, and the stam is pretty decent at 89. In terms of traits, nothing of note there. In terms of chem styles on this card, I think we're probably going to want to be going with an engine, get that pace up, really max out the passing, and obviously then boost that dribbling a little bit too. You could look to go Hunter if you wanted, if you really care about the shooting, it depends how you want to use this card really. Looking at him, you know, he could play a number of positions, you could utilise him as a striker, or maybe even a winger as well, because he has got decent pace, and if you are going to do that, then I'd definitely be saying go for a Hunter. But let's build a squad to get this done as quickly as possible. So the first thing to bear in mind here is obviously it is max chemistry. So for the majority of your team, you can literally just pick whoever you want to use. So pretty much just use your best players in every position, especially for the back line. Um, so for me, obviously, I, I mainly run a Premier League team, but we are going to use our, you know, just literally the favourite position for each each of your, your back positions there in the club. When you get into the midfield and the strike, it starts to matter a little bit more. So bearing in mind that the key things are goals with... Brazilian players, goals with Serie A players, and then furthermore then, we do need to get some assists with cams. Again, because it's max chemistry, positions don't matter, so I'm going to say instead of using left mid and right mid, use cams. Obviously, you could just play a 4 triple 2 but it doesn't matter anyway, they're still going to be on full cam. So you're probably going to want to stick in probably your best cams, to be honest with you, rather than prioritising either of the leagues. Uh, so for me, I'm going to just jump in for my cams and we will go with, yeah, we'll go with Benzema on the left and Bernardo Silva on the right and cutting in. And then in terms of the two strikers you're going to want to use, obviously, again, Brazil and, uh, and Serie A are the priorities. I tried to have a look if there were any very good Brazilian Serie A players. The only one that's really worth using, I'd argue, is Felipe Anderson's in form at 17k. So if you do want to pick it up just to make it easier for you, you can. But failing that, obviously, there are the options of you can use a loan player. And I know a lot of people have a loan Pele, for example, because they were given at the start of the game. But if not, obviously, there are plenty of other options in the Brazilian uh, nation there. So if we jump onto Brazil, we do have the Anderson Talisca one to watch. The SPC. We've also got Charleston's a decent enough card that you can use up there. So for argument's sake, for those people that don't have Pele, although I think a lot will, we'll go ahead and stick with Charleston up front there. And to partner him, again, you just want to use your best Serie A player, really, it, you know, in terms of attacking players. So I could use my lone line Tara Martinez, absolutely fine. If you want to go and pick up a um, Dybala or someone like that, they're all sort of still pretty cheap. Vlahovic, the inform from this week, has got a pretty decent card. You know what, I think I'll use him. 
and then obviously for the center mids again if you want to just use cams there go ahead or if you want to you know obviously they don't actually have to play cam in game so i can go ahead and use my tonali convert him to a cam before we play him that'll still count when he gets those assists and again then center mid i would still say start prioritizing Serie A for these just because then you've got a really good sort of core of the team to pick out those goals um, but following on from that, guys, obviously the Brazilian the Brazilian goals, you need 15, but that's not 15 separate matches. So get them done if you want to pair a couple of Brazilians up front and then start prioritizing Serie A. But realistically, it's very important that the main thing you bear in mind is that it is max chemistry. So you can use whoever you want to pick this guy up. And as long as you're getting Serie A goals and Brazilian uh, goals also. But again, you want to be trying to do this at the same time. So if you have got some very good Brazilian cams, use them but again you know it's, it's completely down to you for the bench then again obviously you can use whoever you want i would be saying you know if you do have a decent loan player in your club do use it because it is max one but you know the loans won't go down for using a friendly so um so yeah make the most of that so i probably will obviously use my pele but i'm pretty sure not everyone has that but the card itself does look like a decent option and probably worth the time to go and get it so i hope this video has helped you if it has leave a like and subscribe and i will catch you in the next one all right peace